What's up everyone, this is Dr. Webb here. In this video, I'm gonna talk about an article that I recently read. And the title of the article is Women and Orthopedics, The Attraction is Mutual. It was released in August of 2016 and uh, I'm gonna go over some key findings uh, from that article. Make sure you guys subscribe to my channel as I'll be posting new videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 5 p.m. Central Standard Time. You don't wanna miss these videos. All right. So I'm gonna pull up this, um, this article. Um, it was in the American Academy of Orthopedic Surgeons uh, Journal uh, in August of 2016. The uh, title is Women in Orthopedics Attraction is Mutual. Uh, in 2014, women, they made up half of the undergraduate students, 44% of medical students, and also 14% of orthopedic residents. Um, this article kind of uh, mentioned that over the last number of years, the number of females residents in orthopedics has increased from 67 residents in 2007 to 105. If you think about all of the number of orthopedic surgeons out there, 105 females is not, it's not a lot, but um, that's a 40% increase in the last 10 years. Um, and any other surgical specialties, Orthopedics has the highest percentage of women, uh, with the exception of general surgery. Uh, surgery. Um, you can see here this um, surgery team composed of all females, and that's becoming all more familiar uh, these days. Uh, the American Academy of Orthopedic Surgeons, it's our, um, it's our um, professional organization, and it has 1,273 members. Uh, 270 are in training. 968 fellows, which means orthopedic surgeons who have completed their residency, but they're uh, finished their subspecializing. And then you have 35 emeritus members. Um, and this is uh, constantly increasing over the uh, last number of years. Um, the article uh, then went on to talk about having a mentor. Having a mentor is extremely important. And they actually did a survey where they ask uh, female orthopedic surgeons, like, why, why did you go into orthopedics? What made you become interested in it? And 27% um, uh, of those people did mention that they uh, had a mentor that influenced their career. 93% um, were satisfied with their career choice, so that should tell you that a lot of women who choose orthopedics are pretty happy in their, uh, with their decision. Um, because 77% of those would choose orthopedics again. 62% uh, had children, which is a lot. So I have a lot of people who come to me and, and they, they state that they want to have children, they want to have a family, but, and they love surgery, but they're just not sure they can uh, have children. This right here tells you that the majority of them do, 62%. And 73% of them are in um, a relationship. Um, so a word about mentoring um, for a female, you can have a male or a female. Uh, anyone that's in the field of uh, orthopedic surgery can be your mentor. It's just seeing a familiar face always helps. So if a female sees another female who is in orthopedics, um, I think that will uh, speak higher volumes um, to uh, assist someone in going into orthopedics. So I thought this was a pretty good review article about women in orthopedics. Uh, it shows you that um, not only men go into orthopedics, I know it's a male dominant field, but uh, there are lots of uh, women in orthopedics and that number is steady increasing. And um, I, you know, we welcome, uh, just like the title of the article is women in orthopedics, the attraction is mutual. We welcome that. And I think we need more female orthopedic surgeons. Um, so I hope this article kind of inspires um, people out there, or women out there in particular, who are interested in a field of surgery, specifically orthopedic surgery. Um, I would say go for it. We need more women in orthopedics. We need the diversity uh, that it brings and everything else that it brings to the field of orthopedics. Um, I think it's a great thing. I currently work with about four to, four to five orthopedic surgeons. One is a pediatric orthopedic surgeon, um, and then we have four female orthopedic surgeons in our residency program. 
um, one who's currently pregnant. Um, she's a chief resident. So um, women in orthopedics is definitely increasing. Uh, this article kind of highlights that. So the article, I'll put a link in the description, Women in Orthopedics, the Attraction is Mutual. The American Academy of Orthopedic Surgeons, uh, August of 2016 uh, article. Um, thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure you guys subscribe as I'll be posting new videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 5 p.m. Central Standard Time. Also check out my new series, Careers in Medicine, where I'll be featuring professionals from all different types of careers in medicine. Um, we're gonna have respiratory therapists, x-ray technicians, radiologists, uh, firefighters, flight surgeons, plastic surgeons, pain medicine doctors, everything in medicine. I want because I realize that not everyone wants to become a doctor. So uh, there are lots of different options in medicine. I think medicine is a great field to go into. So I wanted to uh, bring that to the forefront. Thank you guys for watching this video and we will see you next time.